Hey guys, good morning. It is a Wednesday morning. It is super cold outside, especially for us Texans, and I have a lot to do today. So today I am actually headed out to King Dollar and I will be showing you guys what's new in the store on Instagram and I will record some clips and put them at the end of this video like I have been trying to do and uh, of course post the pictures of the things that I do not get at the end of the video. I also have a luncheon to go to. It is a Friendsgiving with the girls from the gym. It's gonna be a busy day and I just wanna take you guys with me because I know I have been kind of MIA. I am super busy in real life stuff, uh, doing furniture and trying to get my house decorated, just getting through my birthday party, a friend's uh, daughter's birthday party and so on. And so it's been pretty busy. That being said, it's kind of slowing down just a little bit and I will be looking for DIY supplies at King Dollar today. So let's see what we can find. Okay, so I wanted to get a pair of gloves for Boogie and these look like they might be it. Really cute little fleece gloves. He's got pretty much everything else to snuggle up in the really cold days, so I thought this would be good for him. Wow, so this is really cool. They are fabric bags, like actual, oop, drop that one. Like actual fabric tote bags with the canvas fabric on the back. Lots of different prints and styles, including elephants, little old school fashion, really cute. Look at that, oh my goodness. And they're a really big size too, so that'd make a really great gift bag. That is adorable. It's very boho here. Traditional elephants, and then the black and white. Really cute, really big bags. These too. are the wreaths that I used last year for outside on our gate. They're fairly large. And they kind of have like a white and green combination color and they, they look really poofy. I really like these too. So last year, I got a variety of the Let's Bake and Santa's Helper kids aprons and it was awesome. I picked them up so that we could do cookies and just bake with the kiddos and it came out to be so adorable to have everybody in their own little apron. So I thought that was sweet. And I like this here, this Merry Christmas banner. That's adorable. It's four feet and four inches high. I thought, I don't think that's kind of cute. I might get a few of those. Okay, now these are precious. They're about five by five. And they have a the little bow. This is really cute. And they do have two different colors. They have the gold with red and then the red with the gold. And that is just too cute. Adorable. And it's got a nice structure on the inside. Sweet. Pretty. They're big and kind of like this cage style with the gold poinsettia and then the pine. That is really nice. And it's bigger than the palm of my hand, so that's really good. These are really cute too. It's the little bird cages. That's sweet. 
Okay, so these are the bunches I'm always telling you guys about. It doesn't look like they have the one with the pine cones, but they have the ones with the apples and they are gorgeous. Along with these new black little leaf stems, these are adorable. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab a few of the apple berry bunches for sure. These are really cute, the little ornament candies. I mean, yeah, the little ornament candies, that's adorable. They have two different styles, eight in a pack. I mean, excuse me, four in a pack. So they have these ginormous size planter baskets, the hanging wire baskets. And I'm thinking of an idea for a Christmas DIY. So super excited about that going to be super cheap to put together too so that's the best part they're tiny trees five for a dollar 39 with pink ornaments and flowers and some silver touches this is really cute to put on like your office desk or something just fluff it up again make it look pretty but five for a dollar 39 that's great well this is a steal look how huge these things are nice these are actually timer lights they look like candles but they're timer lights guys that is super exciting because they will turn on and off um, at the same time every day as the rest of your lights that is so neat i think i'm gonna get a few of them. okay so i think i have two diys in mind one is requested and then of course i was trying to find something else to be creative with while i was in the store looking around to see what they had and i think i have two things that I'm going to be working on for a Christmas tutorial. It's not going to be anything crazy because as I've tried to tell you guys, there's a lot going on. So I'm going to do my best to bring that to you at least by the first so that you could have the ideas whenever it's time to start decorating after Thanksgiving, unless you're like me and you've already done that, but you could still do it and add it to your decor theme. So that being said, I'm super excited about it. Now I'm going to go ahead and head over to the Friendsgiving with my friends and just enjoy ourselves there. Hey guys, so it is several hours later. I am actually just looking at all of this stuff from King Dollar and there's quite a bit of stuff going on here at on the table. And I'm kind of excited about my outdoor DIY that I'm gonna be doing pretty soon because I had several feet, like a lot of feet of garland from King Dollar last year and it's the green and white fake faux garland and I was kind of worried that if I used it on what I'm gonna be doing that it's not gonna last. Well, funny enough, I actually left the garland out in the freezing cold and the rain and the elements and the craziness that we've been having and it's just fine there's nothing wrong with it and i just stretched it all out to dry so i will be able to do that project pretty soon but for now that is it for today 
I guess we can go ahead and do a super quick haul that I will piece together with this. And then the next time I come at you guys, it will be with the King Dollar Dollar Store DIY Christmas tutorial. Going ahead and jumping into the things that are not DIY or Christmas related or DIY related. We got the White Pearl White Lotion Hand Soap in the Pleasant Almond Scent. It is by the Friedman and Sons Inc. And this is a huge one gallon bottle of hand soap. That is pretty awesome. Especially when you have a lot of kids and you do some entertaining with family and friends, you need a lot of refills. So I was so happy to get this. I actually wanna smell it and see what it smells like. I forgot whenever I smelled it in the store. So we're gonna go ahead and check it out. So it does smell like Jergens a little bit, except it doesn't have that almost like tinge from the cherry because I think Jergens is like cherry almond. It smells almost identical to that, just not so much of a bitter tinge to the scent, if that makes any sense. Whenever you smell it, you know what I'm talking about if you know the scent. Anyway, it's a little bit less intense, but it smells really, really good. So I'm glad I got Next, that. Next, I got the Lysol Clean and Fresh Multi-Surface Cleaner. And this one is in the Hawaii Sunset Essence Scent. I was really happy to get this. These Lysol bottles go for an easy $4, depending on where you shop. I was really excited and they had so many more. I'm actually gonna use these. I've never used this scent before. I'm gonna use these, see how they go over the weekend. And if I like it or the scent lingers, then I will go ahead and pick up some more the next time that I go. But these are full size refill bottles. They are 28 ounces. They are a very well known tried and true brand. Super excited about this. I don't even think the hubby has seen these, but he's actually really big into cleaners. So yeah, that's really awesome. A buck 39 a piece. Alrighty, you can already on to some cozies. So Boogie already tried on his gloves. He has been waiting for them. He is so excited to have his own pair of big boy gloves. And they kind of look like brothers because they do have the little clasp where you link them together so they don't get lost. They fit his hands perfectly with just a little bit of growth room. And for a buck 39, that is awesome. He loves them. So there's that. And then I got these for me and I have been waiting all week to use these because I haven't been able to do this haul all way to use them because we have tile throughout our whole house and we're actually up on a elevated platform and our house is about 12 ish feet off the ground on concrete slabs and beams so the air comes through the concrete and it's very cold on our floor it makes your feet hurt all that and you kind of just want to jump from rug to rug so got these they are so cute they are just this fuzzy like blush pink furry stuff everything looks like it has like fairy dust on it because of the ornaments from the bag but um it's just a really pretty set of slippers and there's a tag in here yeah i'm not sure what brand that is but the slippers are freaking adorable and i cannot wait to slide them on my feet all righty so the hubby was actually pretty happy with this one it is the glade nutcracker delight rich hazelnut and praline scent refills so i actually bought these candles and my child broke them before i even got to use them and king dollar sells the full size glade candles two for 199 so it's a dollar a candle that is awesome and he broke it and i about flipped out but whatever so i haven't really gotten to smell these yet the hubby was kind of excited for them and then we didn't get to use them so i came home with this he was really happy about that these are only a dollar 99 we have a Glade plug-in in our kitchen right now with some winter scents and stuff like that. And it's really helping keep the whole feel of Christmas in the house because when you decorate for Christmas, the hubby absolutely loves for it to smell like Christmas. And it's funny because our friends came before they left town to check out the decorations and stuff that I was doing because we all have a thing for homework and they know that that's like my goal. Anyway. And they walked in, they're like, wow, it even smells like Christmas in here. And so that was like a big thing. So I got these. It is a three pack of the refill plug-in liquids for $1.99. And you know these things sell for a few bucks. So I was really happy with this. Okay, so I got the Boss Stitch 8-inch all-purpose ergonomic scissors with the precision tip, horned edge for smooth cutting, and ergonomic grip for the boys because guys I had about 12 pairs of scissors and I have not one because they take all of my scissors and 
I figured if I got them their own freaking scissors and put them in their game room and all of their crap, they could just have these and stop taking mine. They're very cool looking, very clean, camo print. I think they'll like them. So yeah, I got these for them. So they stopped touching them. One stuff. day, the hubby actually came home and told me that he bought me some hand warmers and these are 10 pairs of hand warmers and basically you kind of move them around and it activates whatever's in them and then you put them into your pocket to keep your hands warm when it's cold. And you guys know, or if you don't know, if you're new to the channel, welcome. At the Bates house, we actually have a huge fire pit and we like to spend a lot of time out there and it's awesome. So even when it's freezing cold, we'll be out at the fire pit, roasting marshmallows, doing whatever we do with our friends and family and it gets really cold. So that being said, he got me these. He's like, that way you can keep your hands warm. Well, he didn't get me this pack. I was like, oh, I think they have those at King Dollar. He got me a, uh, a 10 pack from like Academy or something. And it wasn't $1.39. And he's like, really? I was like, yeah. And I go, whenever I go next time, I'll get some and I'll show them to you. Well, if I'm not mistaken, at one point they were actually selling these like five for a dollar. And I had no clue what they were. I didn't know what they were for because we just kind of wing it, you know? And yeah, so anyway, it's the Remington 10 pair hand warmers, air activated for warmth anytime, anywhere, camping, hunting, fishing, construction, sporting events, and skiing. And yeah, they have them there for buck 39 and he paid a few bucks from Academy. Sorry, I didn't know. Okay, so you guys saw these in the video clip. I love them. If I'm not mistaken, they are the turtle doves. And if you don't know what Paloma means, it actually means dove. It's a symbol of peace and creativity and so on and so forth. And it's funny because my dad actually chose my name and my name is so fitting for me. It's, it's just unreal. But I grew up hating my name and now I love the name Paloma. It's just so different and it has a meaning and all that stuff. But anyway, I did pick up three packs of the two piece little turtle doves and I have one out with the Christmas decor stuff because I was thinking about using it in the DIY but I didn't. Anyway, they are really pretty. I love the little shimmer on the wings. I love the little hollow bellies and I just love how they have some curve to them. Really pretty and I'm going to be putting these into our tree along with a ton of other King Dollar ornaments. I have shown those in previous years hauls so you can go ahead and check out the king dollar playlist and those should be in there but it's just really adorable little turtle doves that i will be putting into our tree Alrighty, guys so that is pretty much it for this super quick vlog slash shop with me slash king dollar haul if you enjoyed go ahead and give it a big thumbs up don't forget to keep an eye on the channel for the tutorial coming up right after this video. If you enjoy videos like this, share it with a friend. Be sure to subscribe before you head out. Hit the notification bell so you can get notified of when I post new videos. Also, you can follow me on my social medias on my Instagram and Facebook group at The Bates House. My Etsy vintage shop is also at Bates House, one word. And for now, guys, that is it for this one, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!